Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hamdan wa syukran lillah. Assalatu wassalamu ala Rasulillah. Amma ba'du. Praise and gratitude to the Almighty of Allah Ta'ala who teach us by wondrous holy Quran that gives us strength so we can gather in this glorious place. Prayers accompanied by greetings we always send to the servant of God who is delicate in character and full of simplicity in his life and be a role model for the Ummah namely the great Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam Salam ala Nabi Muhammad Salatu wa salamu wa ala toha Rasulillah Salatu wa salamu wa ala yasin habibillah Along with ta'zim greetings at the beginning of this opportunity Allow me to deliver a series of speeches to the theme Quranic Generation for Indonesian Success Excellence V, the jury and all beloved audience Our beloved country Indonesia is now a very worrying condition How not? We can see for ourselves. Demonstration everywhere. Corruption is rampant. Criminal acts are becoming commonplace. Which is even worse, the morals of the younger generation are now increasingly undirected. Ladies and gentlemen, imagine what will our nation be like in the future if this situation continues. Most likely, the act of ignorance will be repeated. Naudzubillah Ali. A young mujahid, often we heard that Yod is the hope, the nation, Yod venture per theory. This expression is in that to very pleasant to her and easy to say. To prove it, we have to ask to ourselves what have we given to our country and what have given to uh, we donated to religion. Clearly, God has called us to conduct propaganda for the future of humanity in the Al Imran paragraph 100. For Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Waldakum minkum ummadui Yadaguna bil khairi wa ya'muruna bil ma'ruf Bil ma'rufi wa yanhawna anil munkar Wa ulaika humul muflihun let the one among you seek long and make a call to rightness, enjoining what is good and forbidding what is evil. They are the successful ones. Jama'ah! Oh, Jama'ah! From the previous verse, we can take the understanding that the younger generation is also the spearhead of the future da'wah of the Ummah. It is the younger generation that will continue the scepter of religion and national development. Therefore, be the dream generation for Muslims by becoming the Quranic generation. The generation that makes the Quran as a quid to life. Who believe in the truth of the Quran, read 
understand and prioritize it on it in all aspects of life. Hadirin wa hadirat rahimakumullah. Why do we have to be a Quranic generation? Because the rise and fall of Islam depends very much, very much on its proximity to the Quran. If we are truly guided by the Quran, surely our nation will be advanced, intelligent, successful, and prosperous. And our beloved country will rise from the depression to success, inshallah. Therefore, I emphasize once again that the great role of the Quran generation for the for the for the success of religious and nation. I think that all my peace and thanks for all my attention and apology for any mistakes. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.